kids, it could be cockroach feces. It could okay. be pet dander. It can be dust mites. These are very common triggers in your home. And the takeaway for anyone watching home is if you just moved into a home or, or something has changed, new carpeting, whatever it may be, and all of a sudden there's res respiratory problems, you need to stop that from spreading. Mm -hmm. You need to figure out, and one thing you can do is, you know, get allergy testing on your, your children to see if this might be the trigger. Sometimes th this is throws you off a little bit. It could right. be something else. It yeah, could be mold in there. Yeah, we don't know. Been, that's the one thing. You know, whenever you have asthma, you know, and, and you don't know what the trigger is, it's so much easier to treat the asthma if you know what causes it. Mm -hmm. So get tested, whether it's the mold or some sort of food or cockroach species. Now, I'm curious, Jessica, how many roaches have you killed or caught in your trap? I honestly have lost count. Typically, it's when we come out at night um, and flip on a light. Some nights we've killed 16. Well, here's some uh, encouraging uh, tips for you. Is for I've done that room, many times. There's 800 of them underneath the sink, behind the refrigerator, underneath the stove. So, you know, what you see is just the tip of the iceberg. They're all over there. So, yeah, you know, if you get tested and it is cockroach allergen that your kid's allergic to, then you can take some steps to get rid of them. First, use some sort of non-toxic pet spray. You don't want to use chemicals because that can make the airways irritate and cause the asthma symptoms to get worse. Uh, uh, the cockroaches will come out of, of the cracks and crevices, so fill those with a putty. If it's a, if it's a large crevice, you can fill it with steel wool, and that will block the roaches from coming out. Um, you can set out baits and traps, and uh, if you need to get professional help, call an exterminator and try to get rid of all those roaches. All right, so you back in the back, back row there? <laughs> <laughs> they really are. Well, we're sending these back to Jessica. You really are these back. critters. Yeah. But, but Jessica, we wish you the best of luck, and I think the important takeaway here is if your children are suffering this much, you need to figure it out. Try and get rid of the cockroaches, but also make sure that is indeed what they are. I have COPD and emphysema. I have been using my inhalers a lot more the last couple years.